As with all makeup looks, we need to prep the skin. I moisturise and prime the skin. I use a lip balm and I use an eyeshadow primer. I'm going to go for a classic eye makeup look and I'm going to begin by using um, a nude buttery base powder all over the eyelid right up to the brow bone, um, which is going to create a nice even base, but it's also going to aid the blending when I'm building up the next colours. The next colour that I'm using is a shade darker than that buttery base. and I'm going to place it very precisely onto the mobile lid using a fluffy eyeshadow brush. Working across the lid and not going any further than the crease. The third colour is again a shade darker and this time I'm going to place it on the outer third of the eye and into the crease. use my fluffy eyeshadow brush just to start to blend those colours in and create some depth towards that outer corner. So my fourth colour is again a shade darker. I am working on the outer third of the eye very closely to the to the eyelashes and again creating some further depth to the eye makeup. Moving on to eyeliner, I just want to create some more depth along that lash line and I am using a long wear gel eyeliner. And the colour is Black Mauve Shimmer. It's still very dark, but it has a little bit of lightness to it. And I'm using my small eyeliner brush and I am working that right in along the top lash line. Before doing anything else around the eyes, the next thing I do is curling the eyelashes, which just helps to open up the eyes for a nice wide awake look.
and then applying lots of black mascara and making sure that that reaches right down to the root. For foundation, uh, I'm using a palette and I like to mix up two to three tones of foundation uh, to get a perfect match. For brows, I don't want to do anything dramatic. I just want to really softly fill and define the brows, aiming for a natural look. And for this, I'm using the Benefit Browsings palette, which is a waxy color and then a powder to set on top. For lips, I'm using the same product and the same technique as used for cheeks, so applying the product for a lived-in feel. <laughs> 